making efforts to realize um, um, the John Chen, the Dhaka Declaration, the Education for All. That it's also on, on, on the way to, to realize the, the Abuja Declaration on Health. And that doesn't mean that uh, uh, there are not other things to be, to be done. I think there are, there are still uh, things to be Because if there, is only, if there is even one child in the Gambia who is not going to school, mm -hmm. that is one too many. If there is only one child who is not accessing um, to, to the maximum extent possible um, health services and all these services, I think it would be one, one too many. But for me, I think uh, with, with, with some caution that it has placed us on a, on a, on a great on, a, on, a, on, on the map of Africa. We have always been there, but I think the report has shown that uh, compared to quite a lot of countries, we have done well. Yeah. Uh, if you look at the Gambia, we have done better than quite a lot of countries in Africa with, with, yeah. with great resources. mineral resources. Yeah. With great mineral resources, a small country, but it has done, it has surpassed. So it means that really uh, the child in the Gambia is to a greater extent uh, receiving all, all, the, all the support. But, but as I said, more still needs doing because there is more to be done for our children. Okay. Um, uh, Mauritius, for instance, like you said, were top in 2008, and uh, this time around they've also maintained that first position. And other countries that did well is South Africa and, and Tunisia. And uh, of course, yes, we said the Gambia have improved, but like indicated in the report, one area that we, we are not doing well is in terms of the coordination, but also in terms of reporting. Now, what, what do you think uh, could be the reasons, or what, what can we do to improve the situation in this area in terms of doing our, our obligation as a country to report to the, to the committees, but also trying to put up that structure that will be responsible to collect, coordinate all this work that has been done at country level? Uh, I think coordination for me, a coordinator, is always a nerve center of, of any organization, of, of any group. If coordination is weak or ineffective, everything probably would end up falling like a house of cards. So somebody ought to coordinate. Oh. And, and I think, I know that two, two years ago also, um, the, the president made a pronouncement that he was going to establish a ministry for, for children. And it actually was there on the budget. Um, but I, I think with, with time, it's, it, did not, it did not kick start. But I think when you have a coordinating body, it, it ensures, as Mfah Maraha said, that everybody work follows the, the straight and narrow. It, it, it ensures effectiveness and efficiency. It, it ensures impact. But it also ensures that you meet your obligations. For instance, the Gambia ratified the African Charter on the Rights and Welfare of the Child way back in December, November 2000. The reporting to the, the African Committee of Experts on the Rights and Welfare of the Child was supposed to be two years after ratification. Up to now, the Gambia hasn't submitted a report to the committee. And, and I, I, I know that at the Ministry of, of Justice, they are also trying to set up as a structure, a union or whatever, that would coordinate reporting. And I think, I think um, once, once that, that committee also uh, does all what it's supposed to do, uh, I'm sure we would, we would report. I, I, can, I can bet that probably in 2015, uh, 2018, when another report, report comes, I can I can say for without certainty that that I'm so we would be in the in the top five of the ranking. Okay, um, that that's good, and uh, of course congratulations to all the people in the field who are doing all the all the work. Uh, we do not have much time, but um, for your last words before we, we just close uh, in terms of um, issues of violence against children in general. Yes, uh, I just want to tell people that these people we call our children, they belong to us and subjecting them to any form of violence will never help them because everybody wants your child to be something in the future. Mm -hmm. So let us not, let us all work together to ensure that our children are given the right environment free from abuse or any form of violence so they'll be able to achieve what they want to achieve. Regarding the report quickly, I just want to say that like Mr. Drama rightly put it, We've moved from 49 to 20. This is a great achievement. But what he's trying to put across is, yes, we can do better, mm. or we can even do more than that. We can even go to, to number one. Yeah. So it's, it's like telling us, yes, you are doing good work, 
but you still have more to, to complete. So let us all work together and see the report as a guide that will help us to achieve more in the future. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Amara, and thank you to Jindu also, Nino Drame, the National Coordinator of CPA. It's been a, a great 30 minutes. We hope um, you out there have also enjoyed this program. Like we said, it comes every Wednesday from 7.15, brought to you by the Child Protection Alliance with funding from Save the Children. Until we come your way next Wednesday, uh, it's by from the theme. quality bu mo andal bobu di souvenir peinture baye ko be fanna ci wakar suñu kër wa souvenir peinture ken doti warante sen garantie ak sen quality du xolé ko du xosata ndox du ko yëngal wala sen glacerie peinture bi nga xamné tam ñew ci wata ak ci oil man limuy def lol ñi di wa suñu kër ken dotu la té sen mbir sen building material bi yo mi samp o ngay wajé samp do xantul be ca makani suñu kër sa aajo faju sen peinture bi nga xamné moy oil bi bax ci li di wéñ yi li di bante yi ak wol yi ak fi nga xamné rek moy lepp lo xamné laaj na peinture yeen wa kër suñu kër yene tawta yene chat yeen rek be faw QSOS 4G internet service is the Gambia's fastest and cheapest 4G fixed wireless internet. With QSOS 4G, you can access the internet at unbeatable speeds on your laptop or desktop computer. You can also use your mobile or tablet to browse the internet via Wi-Fi. QSOS 4G internet can keep you connected either in your home or in your office. For a limited time, get 50% off regular equipment and 100% off corporate equipment, as well as free installation and free QSOS credit. For more information, call 333-3253 or 333-3104. QSEL 4G Internet. Fast, affordable and reliable. QSEL. Sunny Bus. The Gambia's quality network. Ya ko 